Hey guys and welcome to a new music class with Miguel. Today we're going to learn a new guitar exercise. It's going to be one. Uh, it's not really complicated but there is going to be one little detail that can make it complicated and that is the beat because it's going to be a faster exercise. Okay so here it's a it's a reggae style type of exercise. Uh, it has normal chords. If you see here you have A. Let me look camera so you can see it a right here and then we have F sharp minor which is simply you go from here and you add the pinky on the third string then you have F sharp minor then you have D right here 11 10 10 then you have E7 9 9 10 and finally back to A not very difficult chords but the problem is this right here is going to be in 150 BPM, okay? Also, when you see these two uh, eighth notes right here, uh, remember it's going to be a swing feel, okay? So it's not going to be ta-ka, it's going to be ta-ka, ta-ka, okay? It's not going to be but, okay? So let me just play it with that speed. You're going to put the metronome at 150 BPM. You're going to click play. If you see it's faster, okay? And remember that you are going to play on beats 2 and 4. You are never going to play in beats 1 and 3, okay? So here we go. 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, and 3. It's not a complicated exercise. The only thing that can make it complicated is the changing of the chords because of the speed of the of the metronome. Okay, uh, it's only that. Okay, this is only going to focus on your quick changes of the of your left hand. Okay, so uh, take it easy. Maybe do it slowly first, and then you move up. Maybe you can begin at 110 BPM and just go up from there. Once you get it right at 110 BPM. You can go maybe to 120, then you go at 130 until you reach 150. If you can do it on the get-go at 150 BPM, good. But be careful that your sound is good, okay? Again, I would recommend going down on the, on the beats per minute and then move up from there, okay? So that you can assure that you are playing everything correctly and then you are getting the sound that you need to get, okay? So don't forget to practice a lot. Uh, record your video with the metronome playing in the background. I, can, I wanna see how you're doing it with the beat. And upload your videos to Schoology and I will see you next class. Bye-bye.